Now this is going to be fun. Hey guys, Vimal here and welcome back to my channel. It's Prime Day and there are so many product launches happening and Hisense also launched their brand new lineup of TVs guys and I'm like super excited about this one guys because this actually packs some very impressive features at an affordable price tag. So Hisense has launched their all new A6 series 4K Android smart TVs in India and the pricing of these TVs starts at only 29,000 rupees guys. Amazon Prime Day special launch and the one we have today is the 55 inch variant and let me tell you this thing packs like fully loaded with features guys it's a 4k uhd tv that has dolby vision dolby atmos support it's like a complete google tv guys and on top of that it's also great for people who are looking for a gaming tv on budget because this tv has auto low latency mode and vrr support also at such an affordable price tag guys under 40,000 rupees so i'm like super excited to see what this tv actually offers at this price point and by the way the video is sponsored by the brand so big thank you to them. Let's get started. So our brand new Hisense TV came in this sort of box packaging. Now packaging was quite big guys. I couldn't do the unboxing alone. That's why I called in my dad for some help. And let me tell you there's so much of information to know here. Model we'll be checking out today is their all new A6 series. That to the 55 edition model. And this is the official TV of FIFA World Cup Qatar 2022 guys. So talking about the main highlights and features, the TV supports Dolby Vision, Dolby Atmos, there's a dedicated filmmaker mode available. And let me tell you, best part is it's a Google TV guys that comes with the latest Android 11 operating system. So I am like super excited to unbox and show you this TV. Let me grab my knife and cut this seal on the packaging. And there you go, as soon as you open it, we've got a mini accessory box at the top. Looks like this is your wall mount bracket for the TV. Yep, there you go. And along with that in the package, you also get TV stands. This is how they look like. And now guys, moment of truth. Let me show you how the TV looks like. There you go, our brand new Hisense A6 series 55 inch 4K UHD Dolby Vision HDR TV. And boy, that is a big TV. Let me just remove all of this packaging thermocol foams on it. So you'll get like a better look and feel. And not to miss out, in the package we also got an accessory packet over here which includes some user manual and paperwork, just make sure to read that. And this is your TV remote along with two AAA batteries for the remote and you also get some stand fixing screws and lastly a mains cord for the TV. That is it, these are all the stuff we got in the package. So what I'll do is I'll quickly set up this TV, fix these stands to it, use it for some time and then be right back to continue the video. So guys, I'm back to continue the video. I've been using this TV for the last couple of days and now I'll be sharing like my complete experience and feedback on it. And let me tell you, there is so much I have to talk about because the kind of features this model offers, right? It's crazy at this price point. First of all, now let's talk about the design and the build quality. So as you can see, Hisense A6 series TV has a beautiful design, guys. It's got a complete bezel-less look over here. Look at this, there is no frame over here. And Hisense is calling it as a floating glass panel, guys because there is no border over here the frame that you see is actually the backside body but on the bottom you do have a bit of bezel guys with the Hisense logo at the center some LED status indicators and far field microphones with the microphone on or switch as well thing is I've told you now it's like a complete hands-free TV that means you can use your voice and toggle Google Assistant or maybe Amazon Alexa guys both these support are there on this particular model we'll talk about that at a later part so that was about the front look and here's how the back of the TV TV looks like. The back panel is a mix between metal and polycarbonate. Good build quality I can say. Let me just give you a closer look and show you all the available connectivity ports on it. Starting off you've got two USB ports to connect some external storage devices and then you've got a HDMI port and this one supports EARC guys. Max video output is 4K at 60Hz and then you've got a headphone jack available. Two more HDMI ports are there so total of three HDMI ports available on this model and then you've got your RF cable in. Optical cable port is also available and lastly Ethernet LAN port and over here you've got your AV in and a dedicated service port available and on the other side is where you've got the AC in port this is where you'll be connecting the mains cord to power on the TV anyways what I'll do is I'll quickly give you a look at the home screen and then we'll talk about the software OS UI built-in apps and features and all of that part 
so this is how the home screen on it looks like and as i've told you this thing is actually like a google tv guys and google tv os is slightly different than android tv so out of the box the tv comes with android version 11 which is the newest and everything is like up to date on this model and here's how the ui looks like now there are subtle differences in the ui we won't be going in depth and covering that because i've actually made like a dedicated video explaining the differences between google tv os and android tv os you can check out that video on my channel so on the home screen you've got different sections there's a for you section that shows you all your personalized recommendation content guys depending on what sort of content you keep watching on all the ott related platforms like netflix amazon prime video disney plus hotstar these sort of stuff and let me tell you all of these ott platform apps came like pre-installed out of the box guys i didn't need to download anything and since you've got like your google play store also on board you can download any apps or any games on this tv and enjoy the complete android experience over here so then you've got the movie section shows and here's your app section it shows you your complete list of all the apps that came pre-installed on this thing or you can even search for all the apps that you're looking for as i've told you and that's it guys and lastly you've got the library section and this keeps on changing guys depending on the type of content you view now let's talk about the tv's performance but before that let me quickly tell you the specs hisense a6 series is a 4k uhd tv and is available in different sizes guys we have the 55 inch variant today in the house and this one actually packs some pretty good features it's got like 2 gigs of ram and 16 gb of storage on board guys i'll show you the settings and show you how much storage is available out of the box as well apart from that this 4k uhd tv it does support Dolby Vision HDR and Dolby Atmos support is also there. EARC port is also available. And apart from that, you've got some special game related modes also, guys. This TV actually supports auto low latency mode and VRR support is also there. One of the very few models that actually support, you know, these sort of gaming related features around this price point. And now talking about the TV's performance, as I've told you, I've been using this TV for the last couple of days and I was quite happy and satisfied with the performance, guys. I mean, look at this everything feels so fluidic over here i didn't face any sorts of lags or stutters on the home screen everything is like you know gliding over here guys even the app opening closing everything was quite smooth and stutter free so you'll be like super happy with the navigation and you know tv's performance at this price point let me also quickly head over to the settings and show you what's available so in the display section guys you've got like your picture settings sound settings and in the network settings, you got the Wi-Fi settings. Yes, this TV does support dual band by Wi-Fi. Both 2.4G and 5 gigahertz is supported. And going to the system settings, in the about section, you can see that the TV runs on the latest Android TV OS, which is Android version 11. Everything is like up to date. And in the storage section, as you can see, out of the box, you get around 7.3 GB of usable space, which is like plenty for a TV, guys. More than enough. You can even download like basic games, casual games on the TV and even play them not an issue at all that's it these are all the general settings available on the tv now let me just quickly open up the picture settings and show you it's got like plenty of picture settings you can adjust the backlight contrast levels brightness color tint and in the advanced settings you can even adjust the color temperature you can even toggle motion enhancement memc motion compensation is also there to get that smooth tv opera like feel on any sort of content you're watching and best part is tv also has like an auto filmmaker mode detection so you know it detects 24p content and automatically adjusts the panel refresh rate to get the best cinematic like results possible at this price point so pretty good features guys completely you can customize and tweak it as per your requirement so these were the picture settings and similarly in the sound settings also you've got like plenty of eq modes different sound modes are there dolby atmos setting is also available because it supports dolby atmos i've told you right so yeah plenty of features and that's it guys now what i'll do is i'll quickly play some videos on youtube and different ott platforms you you just check them out and after that we'll talk about the picture and the display quality of this tv <laughs>
right? So today in this video, I'll be giving you guys an exclusive gameplay demo on PS5, guys. So I've actually purchased a couple of game titles for PS5. These are exclusive PS5 launch titles. And you know, in this video, we'll be checking out Okay, you guys saw those demos, right? What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comment section down below. Now, if you would ask me, picture quality of this TV is actually pretty good at this price point, guys. Now, first of all, before I actually share my review or opinion, keep in mind that it's an affordable category 4K USD 55 inch TV. So don't expect like premium quality results or don't even compare it with like expensive premium models. It doesn't make sense. So talking about the quality, see picture quality was nice. It was having good amount of detail. Everything was looking crisp and clear at 55 inches thanks to that 4k resolution and talking about colors colors were also nice and rich it was producing like accurate colors guys i've seen a lot of tv models around this price point right and most of them have this cooler tint guys color balance is not that good but that is not the case over here hisense has done a good job and it was producing like natural skin tones guys that is what i can say so color accuracy color reproduction was on point though you might have to increase the color saturation from the settings depending on your requirement and taste now coming to contrast levels, here contrast levels I was not that satisfied guys. I felt contrast levels on this TV were a bit less though you can compensate by slightly increasing the contrast from the settings and also black uniformity was like average guys. You know black sort of looks like greyish but again hey it's an affordable category TV so as I've told you you can't expect all of those premium results over here. And lastly talking about the brightness, brightness of the panel was also good. It was having around 340-350 nits which is like plenty and sufficient for home purpose. Us. Now talking about the HDR performance, as I've told you, Hisense A6 actually has like Dolby Vision HDR support and HDR performance was pretty decent guys. It's actually better than a lot of other TV models around this price point. It was having good amount of detail in both the highlight and shadow areas and you'll be satisfied with the panel. Now moving on and talking about the sound. So it's got like stereo speakers that can produce around 20 watts of output and best part is it also supports Dolby Atmos guys because it's got ERC port right and audio quality on this tv was very good it was producing like good clarity minimum distortion and audio output also loud and satisfying we're almost coming to an end so let me show you the tv remote as well there you go this is how the hisense remote looks like quite minimalistic guys just has the required buttons on it and button quality is also nice soft and tactile and you also have a couple of shortcuts for ott platforms on the bottom and you also have google assistant button at the top with a built-in microphone on the remote just press the button ask your question and you'll get the result on the TV screen and best part on this TV is guys it's got like hands-free voice control experience you don't even need to access a remote on this thing because TV has like built-in far field microphones on it right so just say the command ask the question and TV will respond let me give you a small demo hey Google play Vimal Chintapatla on YouTube So just like that guys, ask your question and it will get you results on the screen. Well that's it, our video on the new Hisense A6 series 55 inch 4K UHD TV. Good display with Dolby Vision support, Dolby Atmos is also there, great gaming features at this price point, you're getting both auto low latency and VRR support as well, hands free voice control is there and excellent TV performance guys, overall you'll be quite satisfied at this price point. Pricing of this TV starts at 29,990 for the 43 inch model while the 55 inch variant costs around 38,990 rupees and the brand is also giving you a special limited period offer so if you buy this TV during this prime day sale you'll get 3 years of warranty on this TV. Links will be in the description box below you can check it out there. So that's it for today. I hope you all enjoyed watching the video and got to know everything about the product. Make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to my channel for more such awesome videos. And I'll see you all in my next one.